Hey, what's up guys? Sam from Cubi Studios here, and we are playing some Skylanders Superchargers. I'm playing as Donkey Kong because he's the only character I recognize from the set that I was given from the Wii U that I bought on eBay that came with this game. And, uh, not a racing game so far. I ex assumed, based on it being Superchargers and all the cars and the pictures and stuff, we'd get a racing game. Uh, it doesn't look to be the case. I'm not sure what the hell this game is then. Because we're doing some semi-platforming, I guess. I'm not really sure that we're collecting some coins. I didn't expect to be walking around as Donkey Kong, though. So there's that. I also think it's really weird how they picked the characters for who was going to be in this game. We got Bowser, who's a bad guy. And then we got uh, Donkey Kong, who's not really like a big Nintendo... Well, he's a big Nintendo character, but he's not like the Mario Luigi characters. Who I would have assumed would have been in this game, considering it's all about heroes and villains. Is like the big plot, it seems so far, is like... Are we going to put the there heroes and the villains against each other? Well, then you'd the get point. Mario, and I guess Bowser it, would still work for that, too. The These guys everybody. are talking about something. That sounds awesome. Let's totally do that. That guy is voiced by... Right, Fuck, I still don't know his name. The one on the right here, Flynn, is voiced by the You'll dude who, line, if you've seen my Metal Arms Glitch in the System Let's Plays, he voices one of the characters in that game, and he voices the guy in the wheelchair and Family Guy. Uh, I like him a lot. He's a really cool dude. I can't think of his actual name, though. I can only think of, like, characters that he plays, unfortunately. This is a live wire okay. Use the left stick to move the gremlin through the lock. Flew too close to the sun. Collect I guess I didn't, because I still got the lock instantly, so that's not really a big deal. I don't... I'm not going for the sparks. I guess you level up faster if you go for the sparks, but who cares? These guys look like they're all set to be flying and stuff, but I could have sworn this game was about racing cars. It's not looking like it. It's looking like I was totally wrong. But what is this game about? Right? Like, the front box has, like, cars on it and stuff. I should Google what the, what's the genre this game is described as, because we got a, we got a while with this cutscene. Skylanders, Superchargers, Genre. If you are seeing this, I have is a role-playing platform video game. Oh, so it's not a racing game at all. Chaos, the has hmm. And now faces its I would have thought it was, uh... Chaos has used the power of the darkness to construct about this. It's the Toys to Life genre, yeah, I know that. Meanwhile, I'm just kind of doing this while the cutscene's going on, so I hope you guys enjoy that cutscene. Because you can't skip these. And there's also not a subtitle option, which is weird. Do you think you'd want people to read? Right? The target audience for this game, you'd probably want them to start reading. If you're parents, I probably wouldn't want the volume on this game blasting. If they could just read what was going on, that'd be cool. Oh, dude, check out this fish. Yeah, that was a weird slow-mo on the flip where like it just looked like he stopped moving in air rather than I'm gonna do the flip thing now nah. that Thor? No, that would be Odin, right? Good luck, I don't know. How are we I'm not chaos I'm not really well established in the Skylanders the lore. I don't know what's going on. We got this cat, we got this sloth thing. I think that's a sloth. And we got the groundhog, who's got the glasses on. Um, I'm a monkey. Well, an ape. Donkey Kong is probably an ape. The evil dude's a human, though. Also, I'm pretty sure that guy's voiced by Invader Zim. He'll probably show up here soon. Or by the guy who voiced Invader Zim, the fake fictional cartoon character does not voice something. Motley Meadows. Check this out. It's Viva Piñata. Hashtag copyright. That's fine. This video probably gets taken down for copyright anyway because I got Donkey Kong on it, so... Who wouldn't be... Or who would be shocked if this video stays up? Wait a second. I know where we are. Okay, great. 
Some people are in trouble. If you'll excuse me, though, there's some gems I need to get. And you gold. Give a letter, hand over here? It's the shark dude. Hold on forever. And other guys. We have to do something. And cat lady. Help them before they get pulled into that rift, Skylander. This Where are her gloves so dunk. big? They're like You'll clipping through her shoulders. To save the pit crew. You'll need to lose, use a land vehicle. I already have a land vehicle vehicle plugged in the thing, so thank you. What if you didn't have a land vehicle? What if you only bought a C and a, uh... Hurry, Skylander. You have what's to a space vehicle? A C and air vehicle, right? You bought it used? Oh god. See, the controls on this are like kind of inverted, and that drives me nuts. Because they invert once you reach a certain point, because you can't turn the camera. And that bugs me. See? So once you reach here, right turns you the one way. And once you... Like, stop. Okay. Reverse. Reverse. Like, I drive, I drive a car every day in real life. I shouldn't have this kind of problems driving the car in this game. I, I'm a big boy who drives cars and stuff. Okay, but then I'm gonna go right off that edge. And then now right has taken me here. I don't know how to explain it without showing like a camera view of the controller, but it's definitely off. Check out that flip I did. See, like left turned me left for a second and then started turning me right for no reason. And then right turned me that way this time. Please stop. Please just make sense. Or let me turn the camera so, like, the perspective is always the same. See, left turned me there. This is supposed to be a game for kids. I'm sure they have fun. I don't. Please, thank you. Oh, man. Oh, I fell. Damn it. Hopefully I don't need to go back up through that obstacle course, though. Iron equalizer. I can't explain to you how frustrating that feels. What if I just stand in front of him and shoot? Oh, it locks on. Sweet! Check out that lock on. I don't even need to aim. I can just keep driving. I don't like that the other trigger... So right trigger uh, is the accelerate, obviously, but A is your reverse for some reason. I don't, it's very unintuitive that left stick wouldn't reverse you, but, or left trigger, excuse me, wouldn't reverse you and right trigger accelerates you, but okay. It looks like I'm supercharged or something, so I should be doing supercharged. Why aren't you locked on now? Oh, do you have to just face him initially? And that gets the lock on. Do you like these controls? No. Is there an option to change them up? Button scheme only button or stick scheme it doesn't look much different other than that it removes having to press accelerate and that's it that doesn't I was really hoping there was gonna be something with the camera that would get fixed there but that didn't seem to be the case is this door not gonna open now where are we at here oh my god the controls on this are so unintuitive oh no I have to go up there okay all right all right I get it so I just basically go back where I came from. It looks like there's a secret area in there. If I bust that barrel, I really don't care though. I just want this loot box thing. Hashtag I played a lot of Overwatch. It's a toolbox, not a loot box. Uh, treetop twist horn. What's it look like? Give a preview. That's not the vehicle I have though. I don't know why it randomly showed Bowser's vehicle. I had Donkey Kong with Donkey Kong's vehicle on it. Sure, we're gonna equip it. Barrel nope. Blaster. That was the wrong button. Now I got it. Can press the customization button to customize your vehicle I hope everyone's in for a jolly good time. Customize your vehicle. Okay. If I could drive it, though. Let me tell. If I could drive it, though. Got it. Nailed it. Things are getting pretty unstable up here, Scott. To those donuts. That was for style. Hurry. Shout out to you, viewer. Meet us in the sky hangar. You'll find okay. it. Okay. 
I get through the door. Thank God. So I assume it's got to be easier now that we've got the camera controls, or the cameras behind us, which means we can assume our controls are now centered. And that does seem to be the case. It seems to be just like any racing game now. It looks like we should be racing right now, but I don't think that's how this is going to work out. We're not running from anybody. Why isn't this a racing game? Is what I don't understand. Like, there, we could have racing sound effects, we could get some shells going, we could drop some Donkey Kong banana peels. Oh man. Oh, damn it. I just missed that lead. Or just hit it. I thought I was going to miss it, but I didn't. Now, is there something with the charge that makes that will let me go faster? I'm going to start pressing buttons here. Oh, that gave me like a minefield, so did that. Oh, there we go. I think that's a boost. I think I pressed a boost button. Nope, that appears to be a drift. Nope, that's a drift, not a boost. A is brake slash reverse. We're learning the controls here. Ironically, there wasn't really much of a tutorial. I don't think I'll need it. I'm pretty sure I'll get the hang of it. I'm not even close to hitting that. I have totally missed it. I'm just going to continue. I don't think I can equip that because it looks like it's for Bowser. Clown Cruiser. Yeah, that looks like it's for Bowser, not me. So we're gonna ignore that. I'm getting all the Bowser stuff. It's a shame I don't have Bowser. I got Donkey Kong. I think uh, Bowser's way cooler than Donkey Kong, but that's whoever I bought it from on eBay had, so that's what we're gonna do. Because I wasn't gonna go out and buy Bowser for this, because I don't even think I'm gonna keep this game. Let me know in the comments if you guys think this is a game I should do a couple more on. Because I'm thinking this is a game that we go and trade into GameStop. Personal opinion. But, I wanted to give it a shot. I mean, might as well, while it's in my possession, make a video of it, see what you guys think. Right, might as well not totally waste it. Boom. See ya, Diddy Kong. Oh, never mind. I gotta get to my land star first. And then it's see ya, Diddy Kong. Back to the awkward platforming action thing. A fuel's errand. Get it? It's like a fool's errand. Because that's the same. What's this thing? A wish stone? Ow. I got a wish stone, guys. Why is my element thing going at the bottom screen there? It must mean something. There's probably something I can do Donkey Kong related down there. But I digress. I don't know. James Prong. It's Murky! The Murloc. There's, like, no one watching this video who's gonna get that joke, but if you get that joke, I commend you, and I'm actually really stoked that you get that joke. I don't have any aquatic vehicles, so I can't go do that. I got an air vehicle, and I got a land vehicle. I do not have an aquatic one, though. So, sorry about it, sir. Strong here. What does that mean? I'm strong here. There's another exit Donkey Kong's always strong. Have you have fucking seen his punch in Smash Bros? Dude knocks people out. Oh, dude, pizza. Sweet. Strong here. What does that mean? I just keep saying strong here over and over again. Am I going this way? Because normally to me it seems like going down places like this wouldn't be a good place to be. Uh. Come on. I was lining up the shot. Oh, do I just mash Y? I thought it was I was playing like the slots. I wasn't, turns out. Hurricane Jet back. New power unlocked. Thanks. Sure, preview it. Hurricane Jet back. Looks do I I don't have that character though. Do I need that character? Dude looks like something straight out of a MOBA. What's he doing in here? Ooh. Oh, Donkey Kong's got them jumps. Been hanging out with Mario so much. What's over here? I turned around when they were marching us to ourselves, and I ended up stuck in here. Good thing. Have you played Sky Stones before? I have the newest edition. If you want to try, I have the it's newest edition. If you want to try it, it's called Overdrive. Sure. What am I doing? Welcome to Sky Stones Overdrive. This is a Sky Stone. Okay. 
The sword shows how much damage this size can do. Oh, it's like fucking Hearthstone. Only powerful Sky Stones have special powers, like a sheep with a 1 1 looks like it would have very powerful abilities. Flips over, you can play it. Nice. It's very powerful, but can only be played once charged up. So it's like Hearthstone. Player who goes second starts the rock and play for free. So it's absolutely Hearthstone. Combat occurs after each player's turn. Why do you get combat if you play first? That attack went through and hit you for damage. Have you never played Yu-Gi-Oh before? But the rock hit back for you. Still That's not play. how things work, buddy boy. Your turn. All right. 3 4 3 4 3 4 3 4. Okay. Heal 8 and all friendly stones by 1. Oh, that's the special ability of my vehicle. None of these guys seem to have abilities. So we're going to summon you. you. Place your sky stone in any of the open, spots any open on spot on your side. side. He's going to be in attack mode. All right, that's what I'm trying to do. Great. Trying to play. Now Great, now these sky stones are ready for battle. Your sky stone will win, but take one point of damage. Duh. Oh, a direct attack. Two damage to his life points. I-5. No. Looks like, your like so your opponent doesn't have a sky stone. That means your sky stone will do direct damage. Yes, I. We, this game's gonna go by super fast if everyone attacks every turn. And I get to summon monsters. If your sky stone matches the element of the skylander on the portal, it gets a great buff. That doesn't look like a great buff. It's actually still the weaker monster here. So, I'm not gonna play him. I'm gonna play this one. We're gonna get in some more direct attacks. That's five points of damage. Overdrive he can use ready. his big car thing now, though. It doesn't look that great, though. Deal one damage to two opponent characters. Oh, he just attacked that one twice. Lame. I would have personally taken out the rock. He didn't need to do that to a weaker monster. Sweet, I'm gonna use the vehicle now. Heal by eight. So I should go up. Eight, right? Oh, nice. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we're murdering this little girl. I feel bad. She's, like, just trying to play. She broke out of prison. She's like, I just want to play my favorite card game now. And I'm just wiping the floor with her. We got seven more points than we started with. Your turn. Oof. We're going to put that nail in the coffin just a second here. Here's another three attack. My deck is just OP. Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, we're not going to win this turn. But next turn, I think I've pretty much secured the win here. Unless she plays, like, Dark Hole or something. I should win. Luminous. It was a powerful monster, but Victory. it doesn't matter. It's too late. GG. GG no re. Oh, cool. Give me a new... Did I get the new card for that? Yeah. Toxic Tushy Skystone. It's a butt with serious bite. I get it. Nah. You're gonna be a master at this game. My deck OP. My deck doesn't need adjustments. I should probably stick with a uh, grass type deck, considering Donkey Kong is grass type. Life type, whatever mana you want to call it, I don't know. I assume it's grass, but I could be wrong. Oh, those are bad guys. I thought that was like an effect. I started taking damage and my controller started vibrating like crazy. I was like, just walking along peacefully. Think you got what it takes to go up against Donkey Kong? The DK crew? Well, actually, the DK crew is not present. It's just Donkey Kong, but... I digress. Um... Okay. Check me out. Look at this. I'm like... We're platforming now. Just like Donkey Kong was always made to do. He's small and elegant. And that's why he platforms. Oh god! That was ballsy. That was ballsy, but that's what I do. The double jump. We're gonna smash up this pinata and get some candy. Cool. I don't know what the candy does. I assume it's health. I assume the candy is health. And now we're about to play Crash Bandicoot, because I'm not going to be able to see. Because, again, still can't control the camera. So I'm at the mercy of wherever the camera in the game wants to be for me. And so, not thrilled about that. I would like to be able to control the camera as the player character. 
Gee, what, what was that? Oh. Well, I made it. <laughs> That's what it was. Tactical. Saves time. Gotta save those frames for our speedrun. Check me out at San Diego Games Done Quick. Skylanders uh, Supercharged Speedrun. By me. Number one entry. I know all the uh, frame saving tricks. I probably still have to kill this guy, don't I? Is this lava gonna hurt me? No. I'm maybe more powerful. I am now more powerful than you could possibly imagine. Okay, here's the lock over here. Oh no. I'm in an endless loop. I got my little charge. Now we end it. I don't need to. I don't need to go around and do all those other things. I wonder what the red button does. The red button just like ends the fun and is like, nah, you're done. You're done here. That'd be funny. Up we go. Oh, some that was some elevator ride. It literally just cut right up here like it was a video. I'm just up top here. Oh, there's stuff back here. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give oh, there really wasn't stuff back here. I thought there was, but there was not. Oh yeah, there is. Hello. Get that Y. I'm still not sure what these coins do, but I have a lot of them. Superchargers rug. Plays this legendary treasure in the academy. Uh, okay. I don't know where the academy is, but sweet, thanks. Oh no. Oh no! Fuck. Oh, that's. Well, I should have just walked through it at that point. Donkey Kong, you gotta be faster than this, buddy. Why do they all keep going down that way? I'll just stay up here then. Oh, of course, now it's probably gonna switch, though, isn't it? Okay. We're doing good so far. We got the pizzas. The, pizza, the food does give us health, as it does in video games. Oh, and I need my, uh... I need to switch my vehicle Skylander thing. I'll do that while this cuts is happening. I'm gonna switch the uh, DK vehicle out. You'll need to use a sky a vehicle of, uh, to take down those fighter ships. Sky action going on here. Did it. Sky slicer. Readjust, get back comfortable in my seat, and now we can oh, I don't even get to go and see my buddies. Vehicles oh, it's of the like element are stronger in this zone. Oh no. Oh no. Use the attack button to bring Hang on. down those fighter ships. Wrong button. Is there like a Invert option? Yeah, there is an invert option. Give me that. For flight, we gotta go with inverted. I hope that's saved. Did it save? Yeah, it did. Okay, sweet. It's like we're, we're playing Galaga. The 3D. Have you guys. Did anyone ever play that 3D Galaga game on like the PlayStation and the PC? That was awesome, right? People know what I'm talking about? I really hope people know what I'm talking about. And I'm not just going crazy. I enjoyed it. It was called, like, Galaga Destination Earth or some shit. I want to do a Let's Play series of it, but I'm not very good at it. I, mean, I also couldn't record it because my computer, as of yet, not good enough. I do intend on getting a gaming PC soon, but until then, can't play it. Man, it's so hot in my apartment. I'm just not used to it. As a Michigander, can't take the heat. Cannot take the heat. I need to go protect the ship. The brake button to turn sharply. I don't need to slow down. You gotta go fast, son! I actually did let go of the thing to slow down. But I didn't hit the brake, though, so I do have that going for me. We're starting to take damage. Status report! That's what we need to be saying. There needs to be some guy shouting out, Hey! It's amazing that Donkey Kong can fly this airplane slash spaceship hovercraft thing uh -oh. good for him hey, it's the shark the people uh -oh. Every time you, uh -oh, something bad happens. I'm gonna guess that's the There's bad no guy ship something about the red eyes is cluing me in on bad guy but I could be wrong maybe I am wrong nope we can target a cannon ship of doom okay one cannon dead. Take some shots on the other one. Okay. Where are you at? We're just gonna tank all the damage. I literally just flew right into it and just like let it assault me. I tanked it. 
How's that? Bada bing. Ladies and gentlemen. Rank 3. I don't know when I hit rank 2, but... I guess I did. Wow. Choose a power. You just Picking up treasure is worth more. Rank. Earn stardust okay, but what am I choosing? <laughs> choosing between what? What are our options? Okay, so I guess I gotta go land there, probably. Oh, I thought I was gonna destroy something again. That was not to be the case. Now we're gonna hit this before. There's a little gold thing up here. This probably massively slowed us down, but it looks like I'm supposed to fly through these. Superman 64 style. Oh, I wanted to, like, crash land right onto it and, like, bust up this vehicle, but it doesn't look like I can do that. I'm gonna rejoin the crew. Look at that shark dude. Who is he? He's this dude, right? Ah. Here's the little... The shark man? This is him. Except this one has a rocket launcher, so he's way cooler. Didn't get that aquatic one, but I don't have an aquatic vehicle, so sorry about it. Oh no! Is that a giant cat face? It should- it doesn't look like this dude at all, but anyway, this is the Invader Zim guy, by the way. I just sec listen to it. No, it's Yoda! Oh no. Lord Chaos, sir. You can't do that. That's copyright. This isn't Disney. This isn't Disney Infinity. Yoda's not here. Are you sure it's supposed This is like the broken down Walmart. Uh Yoda. It's like those action figures you find that are unlicensed not actually Star Wars, but Star Wars characters? It's, That's uh, him. Not just the holes, sir. Some of the other trolls have been complaining. About me? What did they say? And don't you wait? I just like this guy's voice. Invader Zim, dude. Oh, no, no, no. Respect. It's not about you, sir. It, it's about the, uh, This dude's poor teeth are all over the place. This is why when growing up, you got braces. That's just the dark to uh, prevent yes, that. I know, sir. But haven't you noticed? It's gotten so much bigger. It's got massive underbite, which is like way worse than Plus, overbite. I think it's Underbite's okay. rough. No, you're imagining you know what I'm talking about? It's where like the bottom jaw goes now. over well. your top one. Money bone on line one for you, that really hurt. <laughs> that really hurt to do that. I feel the struggle though. I've had braces for like three years, so. It's okay. I know that struggle. And I had braces uh, during my sophomore year of high school, junior, senior year. So, I didn't get them in middle school. I got them when I was way older. Sorry about it. Well, not sorry about it. I'm sorry about it. And then I didn't wear my retainer, so, whoops. My top teeth are still, like, perfectly straight, though. One on my bottom is not anymore, and I'm, but I'm honestly not sure if that's because I didn't wear my retainer or because my wisdom teeth are coming in and I still haven't gotten them removed. I really need to do that soon. What are we talking about? What's this game about? What is happening? What happened to the race cars and the blue shells? That dude's asleep? He thought we wouldn't see it? But we did. That was the best moment of the Avengers movie, by the way. Man, this cutscene's still going, huh? Okay. I wish there was subtitles, but there's not. He's using that crutch wrong. He's holding it like a cane. It should be under his arm. That's what you have crutches for. But a cane is held like that. Is held like this, like what he was doing. Just what we're gonna be. Just to we point to that out and make that clear. He's using it wrong. It should be a cane. It's an artistic error. Never thought I'd see the academy again. I never thought Thank I'd you, see the academy Stanford. again. No, neither did I. Might be a little you go. For wear, but neither did I. It's the last it looks like a giant thing of wood Skylands. chips up there. It's it must be for our groundhog friend. I assume. Speaking of which, I need to get to work. Master Eon is still being held prisoner. Still and being held prisoner. More than ever. Oh no. Worry. Mag said she'd be happy to show you around. Hey, it's a night elf. 
I think that's like the third World of Warcraft joke I made in this video. <laughs> then I made a Star Wars joke. I'm all over the place. I think this is a good place to stop, though. We made it to the uh, homeworld thing, so let me know what you guys think of this series. I'm thinking this is going to be a one-off video, but let me know what you guys think. You guys know I'm always listening to your comments and the feedback and all that sorts of good stuff. Remember to follow me on Twitter and Twitch. Those links are, in, are below. You watch me stream. All that good stuff. But above all else, you guys, I hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you around.